Okay, so folks, this one right here is one that we're going to be doing for our portfolio. Uh, all the circle graphs that go in your portfolio have to be done with a um, protractor, not with the 100 tick circles. So the ones that we did for 100 tick circles um, are good for uh, classwork points, but portfolio has to be done with the um, protractor, okay? So the first thing I wanna do um, with this information is change these percentages to um, degrees, because I need degrees, right? So how do I change 25% to a degree? I'm actually going to say 0 0.25 times what? 360, okay? And I get 90 for both of these, right? Okay, now, for this one, it's going to be 0 0.17 times 360. Guys, I don't have a calculator at my desk. Can someone punch that in their calculator for me? Sixty-one point two. All right, so we'll make that sixty-one. Okay, and then how about zero point zero eight times three sixty? Hmm. Okay, so twenty-nine and twenty-nine. Okay, Cameron, can you punch? Can you put ninety plus ninety plus sixty-one plus sixty-one plus twenty-nine plus twenty-nine and make sure that we got three sixty? Yeah, okay, so that's a check. We know we got it right because that's 360. The next thing you want to do is to create the circle. Okay, so you want to create your circle, and you want to draw your radius line, right? And remember, a radius is only halfway. It's from the center of the circle and halfway around, okay? Does everybody have their radius line? Okay, all right. Now we're going to grab our protractor, okay? Take your protractor and put it right here on the center, okay, and line it up so that that line at the bottom of your protractor is zero, okay? Line it up so that line at the bottom of your protractor is zero, okay? Boy, it would be really bad if I had to call your name for talking in the recording that people are going to hear all day long. All right, the first one is 90, so I'm going to put a point, just kind of a dot, at 90, just, just a little dot, okay? Then I'm going to turn, I'm going to turn my protractor and line that up, okay? Now, I, even though my point is outside of my circle, my line only goes from the center to the circle edge, right? Now, what do I write in this piece of pie that I just made? Yeah, sleep or 25%. Do I ever write 90 degrees? No, because that was just the measurement that I used to make the piece of pie. I don't actually write 90 down, okay? All right, then here's the most important thing. Everyone should be listening right now. The line that you just made is now zero. Don't go back to the original line. This is now your zero, okay? I need to make another dot at 90 because my next measurement is also 90. So I'll put the dot here. Now, notice something else on your protractor. It has two scales. Do you see that? One counts up from zero and the other one counts down from 180. Be sure you're using the correct side, right? Okay, be sure you're using the correct side. I've made my dot. I'm going to turn my protractor around so that I can make another straight line from the origin to the edge of the circle, okay? And what do I write here? School, right? Very good. Okay, my next measurement is 61. My next measurement is 61. So I'm going to go, now make sure I'm counting up from zero, go all the way to 60, and then one pass. That's 61, okay? Make a little dot, 
Turn your protractor. And draw the line for 61. Okay? And now in this one, I'm going to write job and what? 17%. Okay? All right, so you do the same thing, and you just continue um, around till you've finished the circle.